Good morning, students. Let's take a look at our reading fluency for today. So we're going to be reading a story that's called Pioneer Days. And notice, since you guys um, had no school on Monday, you don't have to do a reading for there. If you want to, you totally can. But we'll be filling in the dates for May 26th, 27th, 28th, and 29th. And then don't forget again to put your little line down the middle for each one. So that way you know that you're reading twice. Let's take a look at our questions before we get started. Where were the pioneers originally from? What was difficult about life as a pioneer? Would you like to live like a pioneer? Why or why not? If I say, yeah, I'd like to live like a pioneer, would I get full credit on that? No, right? You have to answer why or why not, or you're not going to get all the points. All right, so let's take a look at the front. What do you predict this will be about? We read the questions. We read the title. Unfortunately, we don't have a picture, but what might this story be about? About how the pioneers lived. Perfect. All right, make sure you've read this once on your own before you listen to me. Here we go. Pioneer days. Searching for a better life, freedom of religion, and oppression, many people from Europe traveled across the ocean to begin a new life in a new world. These people were called pioneers as they were the first to settle in the wilderness of North America. Life as a pioneer was hard. They had to adopt a new way of living. The first thing that had to be done was clearing the land to plant crops. Without food, survival was not guaranteed. This was not easy. The pioneers did not have trucks and tractors. They had to use tools and animals. The trees they chopped down became very valuable. They used the wood for everything. Their home, utensils, tools, toys, and furniture were all made from the trees. The pioneers were not alone in the new world. The aboriginals had been there long before they came along. Everyone had to learn how to live together. The pioneers learned a lot from the aboriginals. They learned how to farm, survive the cold winters, and which plants could be used for medicine. Pioneer life was dangerous at times and very difficult, but the people persisted and towns grew and flourished as more and more settlers came over. All right, that's it for our reading for today. So pretty interesting reading about pioneers coming to a new area and having to get along with the people that already live in that area. Notice it talks about how important it was for them to have trees uh, because they were able to craft things from trees. Just like if you guys are playing um, Animal Crossing, you can craft a bunch of stuff from the trees, right? You cut down the trees and then you can craft your little flimsy axe or you can craft a rocking chair or all kinds of different things. So that's a way that we can connect connect the text to, I guess a video game it could be like another, count as another text kind of, or connect to your life sort of since you play a video game where you do the sim similar things. All right, guys, have a great rest of your day.